Hi everyone, it's Brenda. I'm here with a quick share of um, the flower embellishments that I made. And I have them in this bag because I'm going to be gifting these away. Um, but I used a little leaf die cut. And I'm not quite sure which one it's from, but if you're interested, let me know and I will get it for you. And these are these flowers are on the flatter side, so they're great, you know, for not, um, they give a little dimension, but not too, too much, so you can still, you know, get away with your, um, one stamp, if you're within the U.S. anyway. But I have made a few of these, and these are all just kind of what my scrap papers I've laying around. I punch a bunch of circles, the one-inch circles, and keep them in one of my irises ca iris cases. And this is called tea bag folding. What I do is I fold eight circles and then put another one on top. So you need a total of nine one inch circles and you don't have to put the leaf on it if you don't want to. And then um, just a plain circle for the back. So you need a total of ten to make the flower. So you can just pick out any color for the back of your flower you want because you're really not going to see it because that'll be glued down to your project. And you'll put glue on this and then attach eight of your petals going around and then just another flat one on top for your center and then you could even bling that up further but I'm going to show you how to um, let me get a plain one here I'll show you how I fold these I'll use a music note one but take it and I just fold just a little bit of one side over so make it like this so it looks like this and then at the bottom I pinch so that they meet and then just flatten it down. So it's like a cone shape. You can just line eight of those up around the circle and then put another one on top. And it's really self-explanatory to make, so they're super fun and a great way to use up your scrap pieces. So I hope you like that guys. And again it's called the tea bag folding. So there are the few that I made. And thanks for watching. Have a great day.